If you're driving through Burnt Church Road in Bluffton this morning, you might notice a big RV poked at, parked at the Bilo Shopping Center. That RV has Blue Cross Blue Shield's logo on it. Agents will be in the Lowcountry this week helping folks sign up for health care before that open enrollment for the Affordable Care Act ends. And our Jonathan Burton joining us now live from the RV with the spokesperson for Blue Cross Blue Shield right now. And Jonathan, at 630, you told us what they're doing out there now. Should folks really know, what, what should they know before they head down and try to meet with Blue Cross Blue Shield officials? Yeah, good morning, uh, Don. I'm here with Adam Myrick again with Blue Cross Blue Shield. Just telling us exactly what do folk, what should folks bring with them when they come here? I know you said a social, their social security number, and what else will they need? Two things are very key, and that is an expected annual income for this year. So bring that figure at least in your mind, and then also bring your social security number, as you mentioned, and the social security number of any dependents if you'll be shopping for family coverage. Okay, and now we're also looking at this computer. What is, what exactly, we're in the RV right now and this computer is in here. What exactly is this here for and how can folks use it? This will help customers identify the amount of federal dollars that are available to them to help them pay their premium each and every month. They've got the ability to come in, plug in some numbers and find that for themselves. Our agents can also do that for them, but if they're comfortable enough to do that, they can find that here. Also, this will help them determine if their doctor or and their preferred hospital, if those two things are in network, which are very important. We have a number of people asking those kinds of questions. Our agents can help or they can do that here themselves. All righty, thank you so much. Now, um, another question, is this just appointments only can show up or can people just come if they or wake up this morning like, oh, they're here, let me come. Can I just stop by? We'll take anyone. We do have the availability uh, to, to uh, accept some appointments, but we also will take walk-ins and work those in throughout the day, both today and all through our stay on Thursday. All righty, thank you so much. Okay. Um, now, coming back up at 7.30, we're going to talk to you a little bit about what will happen if you don't sign up for health care. You know that the Affordable Care, under the Affordable Care Act, everyone must have health care. You face a penalty if you don't sign up. We'll tell you what that penalty will be. Reporting live from Bluffton, Jonathan Burton, WTOC News.